Greetings. Greetings and the so-called independence we're supposed to have. We know we are in the pen. But the level of passivity make you question what kind of independence you to have. Are you able to think freely? Are you able to express your thoughts freely? Are you able to launch and establish businesses without the encumbrance of the state? You know, we're facing a situation here in my island where we're facing a, a, a deadly media blackout here in Jamaica from the media and from the radio. I mean, you have some radio station like Sunshine, who's brave enough, Sunshine Radio, which is brave enough to highlight some of the pressing issues facing us and facing the global community. But when I say media blackout, my people are not aware that people all over the world are standing up for their rights. It's not a no television in Jamaica. It's not a no radio in Jamaica. The radio is filled with everything frivolous and everything to distract the people them from what's coming. And everybody's pushing a certain particular narrative. And the people of Jamaica, I'm telling you, so this media blackout also serve to dumb down my people even more and all the things that serve to distract them are being highlighted yet you're independent you better wake up it's what now saint vincent and the grenadines and we're on a serious something the people of the region who don't get no news from the media who are going to trinidad Oh no, here we are going and nowhere else. Because the of them in a concerted effort to block the people them from communicating. That's why six feet apart and all them fuck are important. So we can't talk, we can't share with ideas and the media, them people want to trust for decimate and, dis and, and dismantle the truth. And distribute the truth and the facts of what's going on in our world have betrayed us. The personalities that we love and respect, they are a total disgrace to the organization called media. They betray we, people. They betray us. The governments betray we. The police betray we. When they see them are forced all the teachers them in our country to give up them right and, and choose a part, not freely, because let me explain something to you, world. You are all of the concept about free will and choice. And none of you don't know a bomb cloth what free will and choice is. If I present something in front of you and said, choose one, you did not have free will, I coerced you. And I gave you an option, idiots. Now, free will is when nothing is presented and you said, oh, give me this. I choose. Nothing was presented on the table. And I make up my mind and I said, hey, I want that. That's my free will of making a choice. So once you present someone with something on the table, whether it's a cup, a salsa, an herb, anything, and you say, choose the one where you want, and the person take one, that's not free will, that's coercion. We live in a time when most of the entertainers women expect to speak up for the people. Nobody want that. They think Buju is a blood clad canon father. I love my love, you know. I'm a son of destruction I come. I'm going to see them a fool and I'm going to see all them want to do is dance and party and live like fool and waste on a life. And nothing positive is being contributed to the upliftment of my people who they are aiming all guns at. And you don't, you don't see it. You're busy around around and you're busy doing everything except realize that them coming to kill with bomba cloth. I can't save all of you, you know. The most I can tell you for you is save on yourself. Oh, you got to do that first. Wake up, turn off most of them fuck the way you listen to, and find out what is really going on in the world. And find out why are we not receiving news like we used to. To educate us, inform us about things that's really going on, and why our medias are so compromised, especially in the Caribbean region. It is. Me don't even want to talk about it. I want them to look at these things. I want them to realize that this day, them say that we are independent. Oh, in the, we have been told that we were going to be quarantining for two weeks because of a pandemic. And two weeks turned to 18 months. And no, 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 say one ras. 
Most of them run up and down and I go with it and I just fall back and I watch on the blood clot. Look, I'm telling this. You can't save all of them. You don't have to go save on yourself. Jamaica have a mentality. That's why you are independent. You never fall for anything. Freedom is not given to a people. Freedom is something that people have to fight for so they can value it and pass it on to them next generation and to them children them and them children them speak for years and say my mom and my dad and my uncle and my brother and my sister fought. We never fought Jamaicans. It's a section of us fought, the Maroons, while 90% of the people them look on them and say, let them go on. Them feel leave the white man alone and them cause them are like that. And we have the same level of passivity today. Know that they have completed the effeminization of the Jamaican black man where most black men are Jamaica. Don't even know if I'm a man or a woman. They are severely confused. You understand me? So we cannot look to these men. We lose two generations from 2000 to 2021. All we have is men who are busy killing each other. Killing the women. Do not know what we stand for as men in Jamaica. We are protected for our families and protected after the community. Why do you think we would work? Rude boys are saying you got to be a soldier to protect your community. Because that is the way we were. We knew that understanding and loving each other and put political divide aside was very important for a forward mo mobilization as a race of people who desire change. Now, all that has been wiped out, and we have so called bad man, gun man, in pants tighter than the woman, them tights. And most of them are GAY. So you can't look for them to stand for nothing because they already fall. They're walking on their knees. You understand? We want the real men them in a Jamaica and real man them. Yes. For no say. Soon and very soon, we have to stand up for defend not only this nation. We have to stand up and defend each other. If the police feel us our only hope in Jamaica, the military. Look, we cannot stand by and sit by every day and watch your country go down the loop and 60 people have their own laws for themselves but no a different law for you and no 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 blood clot realize you know so stupid sometimes you know hurt me so bad yes i mean i mean you know put in a prison i mean you know say a drug addict i mean you know say all kind of blood clot things but but i mean love one of the most the stone of the builder refuse is always the kind of stone you hear me i love you know so much that even when them come at me, I don't really look at them because it's all about Uno. But do Uno love yourself? Uno love yourself? Do Uno know already? Uno know what is love? Jamaican can't hug up nobody no more because I don't say Uno gay. You have to hug up people and love people. I have to get back there. I have to get back to being a nation where value things. I know values change. I know values change. But real values never change. Real love never change. Real integrity never change. Real loyalty never change. Real honesty never change. Real truth never change. These things are fundamental. These things are foundational principles. You now you're going to hear a lot of platitude pushed at you today and about you accepting your own debt. Now, I want to say something to you which is very important. The word self-defense is very, very important, people. The word self-defense applies when someone is coming at you to do something to you, to harm you by force. If you do not consent, self-defense is in your favor. You will come, there will come a point, because we see it in Australia with them holding down people and injecting them. That's why I tell you, you're facing a media blackout. And the people going to suffer because of lack of knowledge. Who going to give my people knowledge? Who going to tell them my people? Put away your petty strife and your petty jealousy and your petty envy. Me tell you no already. No respect, disrespect, tell you no. Save up on the rounds because you might have to use them later. We are not the warriors, but we know the warriors them out there. But we know one thing. We know one thing. Yes, we are warriors of a different order. A spiritual order. And in this time, we walk alone. Because we're not fighting against flesh and blood, but a spiritual wickedness and a dark force covering the earth. Who rule in high and low places, especially in my country. They rule. They rule with a heavy hand and they are very oppressive. And the suffering of the people. No one pays it no attention. The world, who will see the destruction of business. We have two generations of people in Jamaica. Them dance, them dance, them dance like that. And them are going to dance, sir. 
Because your place at Jamaica where no internet not there. I am place at Jamaica where.